how to study this mechanic. So this just rotates the arm that rotates the vent. And then the side I busted. Uh-oh. Hmm. Basically this little white plastic clamp that holds this arm in that controls the vent flow is just broken. I gotta be honest, I don't think I broke that. I mean, just sliding this thing back in and out, I think it broke some other way. Ah! The thing is, this like requires a lot of force to hold together. I'm not sure the Gorilla Glue is going to cut it. Maybe some wiring? Meeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a. I'm pretty sure I don't want this. Which one of these? Now this thing's still got to be able to swivel once it's glued, so the key will be not using too much epoxy so that it doesn't glue the, the little ball and socket to the white plastic clamp either. It's pretty precarious, but if that holds, it should uh, do the trick. I feel like this next part is probably going to go pretty quick, so uh, no more videoing. Oh, I really hope it doesn't leak onto the clamp and affix the clamp to the plastic. But we'll see in a, about a day. Tea. I don't drink tea. Or what do you drink? Not tea. <laughs> so, I think people watch this for individuals and themes to monitor down to the nature. I had really coated it on this second attempt. So, it should be stronger, but I still bet it's not gonna be strong enough to actually move. Let's just see if it holds when I take this off. So good. All right. So let's look at the other side. When when I turn the the dial, it puts that whole mechanism under an awful lot of pressure. So I think that doing this 
will cause the repaired one to snap open. So before I even try to do a function check, I'm either going to do another big coat that like caps the whole thing with epoxy, or maybe I'm going to get some uh, really thin wire and wrap it around tightly around this little top and then epoxy over that. Got to get an idea what I'm talking about with this paper clip. If I could just, you know, wrap it all the way around tightly, um, crimp it, and then put a coating of epoxy, a capping of epoxy over that over that wire to reinforce. Because again, this clip is just wanting to pull apart with a tremendous amount of force. But I, a paper clip's too big. I think I need to go get something like uh, like the wire that's inside of a twist tie. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to try to do. Moment of truth. <gasps> Look at that. We did it, guys. Now I'm just going to epoxy over the wire to make sure it stays in place. And we're good. Oh, 